What's up, everybody? Welcome back to It's Just Plastic. My name is Helen. You seen the thumbnail? You know what crazy superhero I'm reviewing today. That's right, I got the Boo So So Toys John Lander. You know that's Homelander, baby. Homelander from the boys. Woo! This is SST 0216 scale collectible figure. It's a 12 inch figure. Man, this has been long overdue. This thing was on pre order for like over two years. Two years, y'all. Man, I can't believe it. Finally in hand. There's the back of the box. So freaking cool. I'm so excited. I cannot wait to open this one. There you go. This is So So Toys logo. Woo! All right. Before I get into it, go ahead and hit the like, hit the subscribe, check out all the links down below. I'll put a link for this figure, man, but it is sold out pretty much everywhere. Uh, this is not an Entertainment Earth kind of figure. I will try to find a link that I am that I've used before, like TNS figures. I bought this one from Pop Collectibles. Uh, highly recommend them. They're all in Hong Kong. Uh, I will try to find somebody that's local or, uh, like I said, maybe I can find an overseas and a local. I'll do some shopping for you guys. Maybe I can find something. I'll do my best, okay? One last thing. I'm on the road to 500 subs. Y'all hit that like and subscribe. I'm not joking. I know I've already said it, but please, come on, y'all. Help me out. <laughs> Y'all just go ahead that button, please. Come on. And I do got other links down there, merch, that kind of stuff, all, everything down there. Y'all go check it out, seriously. All right, let's go ahead and flip the camera and get into it. There he is out there on the table. I wanted to open him up with you guys. So let's go ahead and pop the box open. This is one of the best parts about So So Toys figures. Bam, look at that. There they are side by side. Look at that. So cool. <laughs> I don't know if you guys are a fan of the boys or have not watched the boys. I highly recommend it. It is not for the younger audiences. Y'all just keep an eye. Just remember that. It's superheroes, but it's not for younger kids. It's some not for some adults, to be honest with you. Look at that. Ooh, hoo, hoo. They also got Gen V out right now. It's another uh, it's a spinoff of the show. Y'all go ahead and check that out, man. That's a really good show. Uh, me and my wife are almost done with it. We started a little late, but man, it's good. All right, I'm going to pull this out. I'm going to pull the cover off and we'll start looking at all this stuff. Now, this is the pre order version, so it does come with a little extra. Uh, it comes with this, the bases here. This is a gold base and a silver base. Like I said, I'll go over all that stuff. Let's go ahead. I'm going to get this top off. I want y'all to see this, and then I'll pull out all the accessories and stuff and we'll look at them all out on the table uh, there we go <laughs> look at the different head sculpts and everything <whistles> man i'm so excited all right i'm gonna get all this stuff out of the box and we're gonna look at it all together we'll just let this sink in just for a second that's all his accessories it's everything that he came with now these are both pre-order bonuses. You have to pre-order to get both of these. I want to say I think the gold was a pre-order and this one comes with it anyways. The silver does. So let's go ahead and get into the base first and I'll get into those. This base is immaculate. Look at that. <laughs> they outdid themselves with this base. Oh my gosh absolutely gorgeous with the low with the homelander logo right there in the center man that is fire now it just is a screw on pole screws right there and then you get the clamp nothing super special but it works that's all that matters all right so let's get into the bases the pre-order I, I opened this one but it did not open the silver one it's pretty much the same thing just one silver, one's gold. I don't even know if I'll use these. I just think they're absolutely amazing looking. They're heavy too. I mean, it adds a lot to this, uh, to these boxes, to this box. Now the cape is a little pla is plastic. The cape, this cape is fabric, but this cape is plastic. So you, it does move. It's not going to chip or break. But all the rest of this, yeah, this is just. I don't know what it is, but it's solid. 
it's cool so you can display the other heads i like the homelander right there looking sweet very very cool now here's his accessories i will go over each one but these are his shoulders they just magnetically pop on there just like that such a cool design man i'm telling you if you haven't watched the boys yet highly recommend just watch uh just be careful <laughs> it gets pretty vulgar and gets pretty wild real quick uh, so i'll just tread lightly when you watch so homelander comes with a baby bottle liquid does not move around on the inside it's not liquid it just looks like it if you don't want to know sorry <laughs> you have to watch to understand all right he comes with two sets of uh i don't know these kinds of hands <laughs> uh two sets of straight hands for flying he doesn't have to hold anything so we don't have to worry about that two sets of closed fists on the figure itself already is two open palm hands and you get a right hand which is just the one finger sticking out so he's like gonna get you and then you get a left hand that has the thumbs up like he's hitchhiking or just saying good job <laughs> that's his accessories let's get into his sculpts so the portrait on him on the body looks great here's one like happy-go-lucky I think it looks a lot like the actor it looks really good they did a fantastic job could have been a little better, but ain't mad at it. I think he looks really good. I like the little flip of hair there. The eyes, man. It's like it's like they're watching you, man. That's crazy. And this is the reason why I bought it right here. Not the reason, but one of the reasons. Look at that. Oh. And I will get into it. This one does light up. The eyes light up, so we will get into that in just a second. I want to know how you attach it, because this one's got a different attachment. So, you see how that works. So, I'm not sure how that one attaches. All the you're going to have to pop out the, the thing in his neck to get this one to attach. I'm not real sure. But to get the batteries out, you just slide this out. So and he's hollow on the inside. Alright, let me go ahead and put the batteries in. It did come with batteries, so that's good. It's a bonus. I'm going to put the batteries in. We'll turn the lights off and we'll check it out. All right, so it took me a minute. The batteries they gave me were crap, so there's a little ledge right there. Got to line that up in there. Let's see. Let's push it in there. Oh, I guess I got to turn it on first before I can do that. Well, that's kind of chicken poop. Look at that. <laughs> Let's turn the lights out and see what it looks like. Yeah. I got my main light on, but you get the gist. Freaking sweet. <laughs> yeah, that's got a mean little glow to it. I like that. And I'll show y'all how to put that on. I will definitely show you how to put that on. That's a, that's a must. All right, let's pull. Uh, let's move all the rest of this out the way. Let's look at the figure himself, because that's what we all came for. And there's the sculpt that's on the body. There you go. That's what the. So that should be no problem to pop that in. Yeah, that one doesn't get a lot of maneuverability out of it. Not too shabby though. Yeah. Oh, ah, there you go. See, so you don't get a lot of maneuverability out of it. You kind of have to mess with it a little bit, but you get the gist. 
Let's put that. See, that one rolls pretty good. We'll get into articulation in a minute. The only thing that bothered me is this belt's loose, so got to keep kind of messing with the belt, but he looks amazing. He's got a wire piece right here in the end here. Uh, in the end here, there's nothing in the middle, but then you get one on this edge too. But look at that. Home freaking lander, man can't believe it such a really cool character so if you don't know anything about the boys or homeland or anything like that so in my take we're just going to look at it while i talk god them eagles are really cool the boots look great homelander is basically like superman he's got pretty much all the same powers as superman uh but homelander kind of acts like there you go there's underneath that Homelander acts as if like Superman's not a Boy Scout. Like <laughs> he's got a grudge against the world, but uh, he doesn't let people know that right off the bat. So, uh, but I really think the boys is uh, is the way superheroes would act in reality. Just my take on it. That's my personal opinion. If you had as much power as a god. Uh, but there's also characters that don't, you know I mean? They have like weird little, uh, superpowers and, and they got cool superpowers, but then they have tragic superpowers and, you know, how would you react to that? You know what I mean? So there's a, there's a lot going on in the boys and, uh, yeah, he's, it's just, like I said, it, it's not for everybody. It's a different take on superheroes, uh, but that's nice and padded. It's definitely worth a watch if you can stomach it. I, I enjoy every minute of it. So maybe not every minute, but <laughs> there are some parts that uh, I don't enjoy. But most part, I enjoy. I'm. A, I enjoy it. It's a crazy show. This this is just awesome. They did a fantastic job. The fabric looks great. It bends. It moves. Let's get into articulation. So this is my own personal copy. I won't be going in crazy with it. But uh, there's down. Up's not so great, but it's just a ball swivel. 360 shouldn't be a problem. I'm getting looking at you. <laughs> there you go. So since those are magnetic, they do move really well. I'm not going to stretch that fabric, but it looks like it would go even further. Let's see here. What kind of what kind of elbows do we got? Got a good elbow maneuverability there. Got some extra padding there. Just has a ball swivel wrist, which is not the best. The, the hands like to pop off, especially with these gauntlets pushing down on them. So that's the one part I dislike about So So Toys is the, but Hot Toys does it and everything else as well. So, you know, it's not much that you can do about that. Let's see, ab crunch. Good ab crunch and it stays, wow. Back crunch, really nice. The fabric maneuver moves very well. They did a, they have a great fabric here. Uh, I don't feel like I'm gonna rip it or anything like that with some of these. Knees are good. You get an upper torso or upper thigh swivel. That's nice. And then you get a swivel. The boots, the, the boots here, the ankle, not so great because of the having the boot there, but. I'm pretty sure if you, you could probably get a little something out of it, but yeah. Ankle's not the best, but the rest of it moves pretty dang well, to be honest with you. I'm going to do a museum pose with him, uh, so that'll be all I all I care about personally. <laughs> See, his hand popped off again because it's pushing down on it. That's the second time it's popped off on me. Overall, highly recommend. If you're a boys fan, if you're a Homelander fan, highly recommend this figure. I think right now the Starlight is coming out from SoSo -So Toys, and I believe the, uh, they have Butcher uh, that's out right now. So y'all go check those out and uh, see if you can get you one. And I know Soldier Boy is coming soon. Woo -woo. My other favorite character, and I won't ruin about who he is, but man, it's basically Captain America. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> 
All right. So that's going to wrap this one up. Whew, boy, this is a fire figure right here. Fire. All right. I don't know if uh, just me or not, but I'm super stoked about this one. Y'all let me know down in the comments whether y'all really like this figure. Eh. What do you like the boys? You like the show? Eh. You know, let me know what how y'all feel about it. I'm super stoked. I cannot wait for the next season. Season four is coming uh, in 2024. We've got a long time to go, but... I still is super happy and I can't wait. And Gen V is really good. It's got some eh moments just like uh, the boys do. But for the most part, I enjoy both of these shows. So, all right, that's going to be it for today. You guys take care. Have a good one. And remember, it's just plastic. <laughs>